What is up boys and girls? Welcome back to another Ioki video. Today we're playing some mid lane Mondays where we play mid lane on Mondays. And guess what guys? We are going to be playing what is supposedly, allegedly, the hardest champion in the entire game. Now I have heard for years that, you know, support players are bad, they don't have mechanics. So we're going to be finding out today if this champion is actually difficult or if she is just a little bit elo and ego inflating. So we are against a pike mid. So we have a support player playing mid lane and a support playing mid lane. Interesting. But uh, yeah, guys, let me know down in the comments if you guys think Katarina actually is difficult or if the people that play her just think that she's difficult. Uh, you know, she is very, very flashy. I'll give her that. There are a lot of uh, a lot of things going on. Whoops. But um, I don't know. Like this champion seems a little bit on, on the broken side, to be honest. We'll see. Uh, this is literally possibly my third time ever playing Katarina. I'm not sure. We, we, we've played her before a couple times as support. Uh, so, you know, I know what her abilities do, but I'm not going to, like, sit here and claim to be any sort of, like, master that knows all the matchups and combos and stuff like that. But honestly, that's just going to, like, prove my point, I think. Because we really don't know what we're doing, and I'm pretty sure we're still going to pop off. We'll see, though. Um, basically, in this matchup, I'm pretty sure I'm just gonna, like, bait out his hook, and then let him hook, and then once, the, once, oh, once we're not inside of an entire minion wave, we're going to be looking to all in him. Got a lot of really, really good ways to dodge his, uh, dodge his hook and dodge his E. Unless he, like, lands, like, the full, full combo on us. Just don't think this guy can really kill us or do anything. Bought the cannon. Our bot lane is feeding as per usual. Alright, our top lane is losing as well. Um, She should have him. Is he actually going to live? Dodge out of that. I will say, uh, my time playing mid lane has been really, really fun. You guys seem to be enjoying it as well. So let me know down in the comments who you guys want to see me play as next. We are totally fighting this, by the way. SG is not allowed to do anything like this. Okay. Oh my god. Yep, looking like a pretty tough champion, guys. I did have to focus up there a little bit, but... Oh my god, what is this guy doing? Relax there, big boy. But okay, coming out of a... Their invade with two kills, not bad at all. I gotta be careful about this set, because he just wants to smash me into the turret. Oh man. Gotta go in for that cannon, though, man. You already know. Oh man, I... I I didn't think that would kill me. Did I get hit by the true? Just got hit by the true damage. Nope, no true damage, just the physical. Wow. All right, well, I didn't think that would kill me, TBH. Um, let's go for... Honestly, this is just one of those champions you can kind of just build whatever you want, so... Well, uh, yeah, I mean, I, I, I guess we'll go for tier two boots and then go into Divine Sunder, I suppose. Why not, guys? Uh, four runes, guys. You got Conquer, since you stack it up really, really fast. Triumph, Legend, Tenacity, Last Stand, Relentless Hunter, Sudden Impact, since you're going to be dashing over, you know, da dashing around, bouncing around the whole team fight. So really, really good usage up there. Alright, so I know this Pike has no Flash. Now he has no Q. Okay, I mean Katarina is one of those champions that just like always feels like she has the ability to outplay you Like she has no cooldown. She has she's zero cooldowns. No like any sort of like energy bar to manage or anything like that Feels like the ultimate like outplay you champ Which if anything in my opinion kind of makes the champion like easier Um, Master G's top. We can look the look the dragon here. All right, we've got our ulti now. Pretty good wave clear as well. Wow. 
Katarina's whole thing is like shovel wave and then roam. So let's get to roaming, baby. Pop my pot on the way down. Oh yes. Oh yes. Oh my god. She's she's interested. Just to make sure she doesn't get out. Now I'm sure I'm gonna have some like 8 million one trick po 8, 8 million mastery point one trick pony uh Katarina in my comments telling me. You know, oh, you played this, you played this so sloppy. That combo where you pressed Q, Q, W, W, E, 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 E. That should have been a Q, Q, W, E, 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 R. So, you know, it is what it is. We'll get cleaner as the game goes on. We're definitely gonna die here, but they're gonna, they're gonna have some casualties as well. And hopefully we can get the dragon here. And Pike misses ult. Yo. No, we didn't kill her. Alright. I got Sheen now. Hopefully we still get the dragon. Not sure if we will or not. Alright. Pike. Let's see what you got, big boy. He has like no mana. It, I, I will admit, my time playing mid lane has been fun. The champions I'm finding ha myself having a lot of fun with are like the hyper carry, like 1v9 super mobile champs, like Akali. I mean, Vex isn't super mobile, but I really like her. Silas. It's fun to be on the other side of the, uh, the coin, you know? Um, yeah, we'll run to this. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. The classic just jump into them and spam buttons, Katarina, baby. <laughs> Holy Lord. Getting that first kill, it, it is, uh, it is kind of a dopamine rush, not gonna lie. Okay. So yeah, like I said earlier, Katarina is one of those champs you can kind of just build whatever you want. I'm going to go like tanky-ish. It's like a br weird bruiser AD build, but it still does a disturbing amount of damage. I just need a little bit more gold to get my mythic, so we'll stay out. In and out, baby. In and out. We'll be able to get that one. I'm glad I roamed though. I was thinking about staying for the plate. Ready for trouble. All right, we just want to get this shoved in. Dodge out of that. Swing. All right. Uh, actually, I need 50 gold. Do I really want to sit in base that long? We'll stay. We'll stay. This might be greed, but. Dude, my Q poke actually does like a decent amount of damage too. Maybe I should be playing more aggro in lane. Hmm. Well, guess I should have left. Guess I should have left. We'll play Pike. Dang, man. Well, that was just really, really greedy timing to dive, and also unlucky. But it's okay. That's what mid lane Mondays is all about, guys. Finding the absolute limitations of these champions. Um, Nasher's Wits in Blade of the Ruin King. No idea which one's the best. I guess we'll go Nasher's because it sounds the coolest. Without mercy. Oh, you know what else I should be doing? I should be turning off indicators so that my abilities come out a little bit faster. That's all about those those twitch quick reflexes, right? She out. My way. 
At 1k. Oh, it reset. Oh my god, these guys are doomed. No way, man. No way, bro. I actually got... Oh, I didn't get the reset on the E. Wait. Okay. Stunner. Woo, baby. All right, there it is. There it is. Clean team fight. Good stuff, boys. Boom. Okay, wait a second. Look how much value I've gotten out of my mythic. No, no, no. 500 damage to champions. 463 healing. What? I've only used it in one fight. That's insane. This champion's cracked. A shout out to a teammate. Could have maybe baited out his ult and then dodged that, but. He wants to go in. I don't want to go for a dive. A little bit lower. If if at least tanks, we can dive, but I don't want to die again. That that landed. We just don't have vision of him. <laughs> Only fools have it. Okay, okay. That was probably lethal right there. Thank you. Jump over to the raptor pit. Oh no. Dude, how insane would that would that have been if I actually got out because of it? Unfortunately, uh, Master Yu is cutting me off one way and Jano is cutting me off the other, so I really had no options to run, but we killed the Master Yi too, so I'm okay with it. Um, let's go for... Let's just go for Bork, I guess. Why not? Oh. Oh, rip. Ripperoni. Dude, I cannot get over how, like, how much damage my Divine Center has already done, though. Like, what, what in the world is that? Yo. This guy is, like, not dying. He's got him. No way. <laughs> he put up a good fight, though, man. Good God. Okay. All right. Uh, as she's on Rift Herald, I'm heading over there. Should be free. I'm going to cut him off on the long. Luckily, I'm against a Pike who has absolutely no wave clear. Okay. Yoink this. Get one of these. We are sitting pretty, man. Uh, yeah, why not? Drop this mid. No, oh, Janna, please. Alright, we still got the turret. It's W, get my speed boost out of there. Oh, baited out a stun. Don't think we still, we want to be fighting this though. Actually?
Bro, what is this? They're just all focusing me, man. I guess I guess that's the Katarina. <laughs> that's what happens when you play cat. Is you do just get focused. So I need to be playing a little bit safer, letting my team kind of like start the fights or frontline for me a little bit. Because the second you jump in, you're getting focused. Oh. That was almost clean, Pike. Alright, alright, alright. Let's focus up now. Let's focus up. We got this. We got this. It's starting to click, guys. It's starting to click with me. Play for this next dragon. I mean, I, I, you guys saw the vision, though, right? Like, I jump in, I get reset on Janna. Then I just jump to everyone else, get reset, reset. Bro? Let's take another kill. All right, uh, let's play for dragon. Oh, someone in there. It's Kaisa, it's probably Janna in there too. Eight. <laughs> that was kind of cracked. All right, sweet. There's the vision, man. If you can get that uh that double double dagger into the ulti. But again, I'm very squish, and when they're in like actual 5v5 scenarios, they're not gonna let me do that, so. To just let my teammates start fights. Katarina is the ultimate cleanup champ. Maybe we can kill this guy. Good prediction, good prediction. I really want to jump onto that dagger. A lot of Katarina, is, it feels like, is just freaking like impulse control. No! Okay, so what happened there? I wasted my E. My first E killed Master Yi, and then I E'd right back into the same place, and I was there for the Pike ult. If I was like 10% better at Katarina, I E to the Yi, kill him, and then use my next E to dodge out of the Pike ult. I like this though. I like this because I like playing champions like Pike and Katarina, where it's like you can look at the last team fight that happened and kind of just like analyze like what you could have done better, what you could have done differently. Um, Wits End. I don't really think I need Wits End. They're all AD. I think we just go Randuins, bro. Got my. Weird little bruiser tank, tank melting build. This is fun though. Katarina is a weird champ where it's like, I kind of feel like I'm playing with my brain off, but also my brain is like super, super active. Like I'm not thinking about the things that you normally have to think about with League of Legends. Like, oh, do I have mana? Macro, stuff like that. I'm mostly just thinking about like, how do I play this next fight? Okay, lots of action going on up top. Holy god, it's just a freaking fiesta up here. Wait, this is, wait, this is the triple kill though. This is the, this is the Katarina triple kill. <laughs> okay, that'll give me a dagger to pick up. Oh, I can't reach her, bro. Bummer. Shouldn't have gone for this set. Okay. Don't think we jump in on Janna. We just get CC'd under turret. Alright. Sweet. 14 kills. Not bad. Not bad. I think we're going to hit a nice little 20 stack this game. They're gone. We get this. Oh my god, we're getting Infernal Soul too. Yes, please. Blue card! He actually died for his color blindness there. If he had just picked yellow card, he would have gotten the easiest kill ever. Man, 
why do they have to have a Janna? I feel like Janna is like the ultimate anti katarina champion. Swing, swing. I didn't get that cannon? I'm tilted. All right, time to do tilted Katarina things. I can't wait. Okay. Apparently tilted Katarina things is good. Got one minute till next drag. Stop it, my farm. Uh, I have full randoins when I go back. Okay. In and out, just like that, baby. I mean, the nice thing about, like, getting targeted by everything in team fights is that they have to, like, they have to keep watching me. Yeah, they have to focus me, which just lets my team do whatever they want. Woo! Okay. Okay, are you guys starting to feel it? You starting to feel it? Dude, the, the Aoki Katarina arc is off to a strong start, I gotta say. 4,000 damage from Divine. Like, what is... How, why is this champion good with every item in the game? All right, now I want Stopwatch. No or Zonia's, rather. Sell this and grab Stopwatch. Randuin's active on one. Dude, give me, a, give me an Infernal Soul for our first game of Katarina mid, please. Please, bro. Oh man, I get better with farming. Oh my god. Oh my god. You guys don't have a turret. <laughs> Yo, what? Did I just ultimate two times in one fight? Hang on. Hang on just a minute. This champion cannot be balanced at all. Hardest champ my butthole, man. That's crazy. Alright, freebie. Oh, my dagger went over there. Dude, if I could, I would just ult Gromp. Alright, uh, let's go get full Zonies, I guess. I am literally full build. Oh. Dude, that was sick! I jumped to my own teammate. Come here, Pike. Come here. Oh, Master Yu's over here. Bye bye. Mm. Oh my god, you're cringe. No, man, if the dagger dropped, I get the kill on Kaisa, which probably gives me enough triumph to live there. So close, bro. All right, uh, last item. Let's go for some more AP. Again, don't really know what good builds are on this champion. It literally just feel, feels like you build whatever you want. Randuins has had pretty decent value. Divine Sunders has insane value. Bork, great value. Zone is great value. Uh, Shadow Flame will be good. Guys, next time we play this champion, I'm gonna just gonna go like full AP, like full AP assassin. 
there's been a couple kills this game that like if i had just a little bit more damage we could have gotten reset this item's broken all right let's see i just want to go for a 1v9 not gonna lie Oh, she had flash. Okay, oh. You're joking me, man. Come on. Come on. So many health bars going down to 10 HP. Where's. Oh, my gosh. So close, guys. It's okay. Limit test. Limit test. Close. That was close to a quadra kill there. I can't wait to see what my damage start is, man. Like, I've done 6k damage from Divine alone. Like, I've got to be up to, like, 50k damage right now. At least. 20 seconds on Soul. Uh-oh. Malphite went in way too early. Way too early. Oh no, ult out, ult out, ult out. Use your ult. Oh God, what was that, man? Why was it so slow? Well, this is technically my fault because I died before soul. Elise saves the game. Bro, nobody's dying. Where, where, like, where all their, like, their sustain is coming from? I don't get it. All right, all right, all right. Game just got really, really hard. We just lost our, our soul. We're gonna be missing out on a lot of scaling there. I think they're probably gonna get Baron here as well. Oh, they just have, they just have a late game fed Master Yi, man. As broken as my champion is, I think I think late game master you might be even more broken. KK, new plan, heal me. Alright, we're gonna play for Baron and then we're gonna walk at mid. They are they are outscaling at the speed of light, guys. Uh, I'm gonna go for Elixir of Sorcery. And I really, at this point, I do wish I had just gone full, full AP instead of like Randuins. I can actually do this. Set spot. I don't know. Just, just, just do the Baron. Just do the Baron. I don't want to tank it though. Somebody hit it. Somebody hit it. Oh, he should have taken the uh, the blast gun there, man. Can I take it? Nice. Oh, now I'm over here though. <laughs> okay, got the Baron as well. Okay. Okay, now we should be able to end it. Well, that was almost disastrous. Should be able to walk it down mid here, guys. It's getting free damage. Don't think I go in on that. Pikes up in 10. 
Kais is up. Oh my god, I'm actually alive too. No way. Uh, Pike is up. Let's dodge out of that. Oh my god. That damage came out fast. Woo! Baby! Let's freaking go. Alright, well there it is guys, 24 kills on our basically first time playing Katarina. We have played her like once or twice before, but uh, this was the first time like trying to actually figure her, out, figure her out. So let me know down in the comments if you guys enjoyed this game. Let me know down in the comments who the actual hardest champion in the game is, because I've heard a lot about how difficult this champ is, and like, I don't know, we had, we had a couple goober deaths, but other than that, I feel, I feel like we played pretty well, but there it is, guys. Look at the damage charts, too. <laughs> 60,000 damage. I did more damage than, like, my top laner, my jungle, and my ADC combined. That's pretty cracked. Um, there's the runes if you guys want to try it out yourself and itemization. Uh, and, yeah, see you guys at the stream for mid lane Mondays. Take it easy, boys. Peace. Uh.